have here this Nikita 18 volt 3 amp hour lithium ion battery. It's one of the old ones, it's got no um, battery indicator on it. This one has a couple of problems with it. It won't charge. The voltage is very low and I brought up the voltage using the jump start method, but that hasn't solved the problem. So what I intend to do is replace the circuit board and also discovered another problem. That out of the casing, these eight cells are about 3.49 volts, but these two in the end are show you now. They're about two point five seven and I think this is even lower voltage. Point five seven. So these two cells in the end are effectively lower than the rest, which gives you cell imbalance, which is going to create a problem in that pack. Even though the voltage is up to chargeable voltage, these two are lower than the rest. But I have a solution. The solution to the problem that I've highlighted involves this Milwaukee battery. This Milwaukee battery has the opposite problem of this one. It has eight bad cells and two good cells. The two on the end here are 3.7 volts each, whereas the rest of them are all below one. So what I'm going to do is pop out these two cells and pop out these two cells with the good cells from this, which are closer in balance to this pack and to this, replace the circuit board. Then I'll have a good Makita battery. What you need is a sharp screw there we're just to pop these spot welds off. Right, that's the two of them removed now. In reasonable condition. The next thing is to pop the two cells out of the Makita pack. That are suboptimal. So that's them successfully removed. Now it's time to slide these two young, get them tacked on, hopefully. There. So with those two cells replaced, she's sitting in a very healthy 17.88 volts, so that's pretty good. That's chargeable voltage. Um, I could try it in the charger, but I might just replace the circuit board as well when I've gone this far. Right, uh, that's the battery back in the casing now. So the next thing to do is remove the circuit board. There's a wee screw here. Just screw that out. And I'm going to have to cut off. I'm going to cut that off just. Now. Set it off then. Just put the new one on here.
So it's everything in place. Let's get this together. That battery is fully charged now so if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and check out my other videos.